A person standing close to the edge on top of a 128-foot building throws a baseball vertically upward. They tell us that this function here models the ball's height above the ground. It says, after how many seconds does it reach its maximum height? And they tell us to round to the nearest tenth, which is one decimal. So let me draw a little picture to explain what's going on. So here's our building, and the ball is being thrown from the top of the building, and it's being thrown up like this. So we want to know how long it takes for the ball to reach its maximum height. So the function that models the path of the ball is actually given in the problem. It's s of t, and that's equal to negative 16 t squared plus 64 t plus 128. So this is an upside down parabola. So it's really cool because if you throw a ball up, you can roughly approximate it by a graph uh, like this. So we want uh, the value of x, in this case it's t, at which it reaches a maximum height. So recall that the t coordinate of the vertex is given by the formula negative b over 2a. So all you have to do in this problem is work this out and that gives you the answer. So a here is equal to negative 16 and b is the 64 here, so b is 64. So t is equal to, it'll be negative 64 over 2 times negative 16. So that's going to be negative 64 over negative 32. So that's just 2. So it's going to take 2 seconds. So if this person throws the ball up in the air, it'll take 2 seconds. And that is the correct answer, 2 seconds. I hope this video has been helpful.